Hey guys, so today I wanted to show what came in the mail from scrapbook.com. I purchased the Memory Dex holder by Heidi Swap, and I knew it was blush, and I knew it had these little crystal handles, and I really thought that was cute. They have a choice of black or pink, and I know there's a white one, but I don't know if that one was available at scrapbook.com. But they had this in stock and they had the punch in stock. And I really wanted to try these because people look like they're having a lot of fun decorating them. And they remind me a lot of a tag. What I didn't know is how adorable this thing is. I hope it's coming across. Can you see all that glitter? There's a sheen inside here. There's her name. And then, I mean, it's very, very pretty. I'm very happy. And the second benefit to me getting this is that now I need to clean up my craft desk so it can sit on my desk. And then for each holiday, I plan on putting a memory Dex card on it. Now, I also purchased these. These are supposed, they're little silicone holders. They're supposed to hold whatever it is, I believe, up top here so you can see it. These were $5. <laughs> so there must be some sort of patent on these because they're itty bitty and there's nothing to them. So they're $5. That was a splurge. But you know, this was reasonable. This was like, I don't know, $17.99. And I think this was $18.99. Plus they had 6% off. I purchased it on Thursday and I received it on Saturday today, which I am shocked I received it that fast. I did make a couple of cards. So I made an Easter card with the Simple Stories Hello Easter collection. And then this bunny is a Tim Holtz bunny. And I have the die around here, right here. This is a, a sidekick. Um, it's a little sidekick side order. And I mean, just look, you, you see how he did his and then you see how I did mine. Never judge the package. If you're not um, a distress, inky type person, don't judge the package. Just look at the shape and make what you want. Um, so I made this. And when it came, I couldn't, I couldn't slide it in here. This was too thick. So I just added this to the back. So I just added another back. This is not very sturdy. I will say that. So this may have to be replaced as time goes by, but I haven't placed these on there. So let's see how this goes. Okay. Let's put her down. And I mean, this, this is a perfect fit. If it were any bigger, it wouldn't fit. Okay. So it's, I mean, literally it's just silicone. You just put it there and this is really smooth. Okay. There, there you go. Voila. Look at that. It holds it just like this. So it holds it just like this. And then it will sit on the corner of my craft desk. Oh, I love that. And then when you flip it, you're going to see the back side hanging. And I mean, talk about it just barely clearing. So I got lucky with that. I made mine when I was buying it on scrapbook.com. Somebody mentioned how big will it fit regular Rolodex. And they said, scrapbook.com said it was four by three and three quarters. And then this was three quarters of an inch. Let's see. Yeah, that is three quarters of an inch. And I made mine a little bigger. So let's see. Mine is, I have to take, let's see, do it this way. Four and a quarter by four. So four and a quarter by four is the largest that's going to fit in there. So that, that works. Okay. So then I made a little Hello Kitty one and this one should fit because it's, it's smaller. And then I made this by photo play and oh, that looks a little crooked. Hopefully that will fit. Now I made that one a tab and yeah, it, 
it fits. So let's measure this one. And I did not finish these off, so I'll put another piece that will make this sturdier. And they should put, they should make a hole reinforcer for this. So this is a, it's four and a quarter by four. I just got really, 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 really lucky that they fit, but they, they could be trimmed down. And um, if you watch my channel, you know I purchased this by, from Photo Play, Baskets of Bunnies, and I was playing with the paper. Oh my gosh, look at this tag. So I'm going to have to make a video with those cards. And then I made a big tag using, because I was playing with this die, and this is the Spellbinders 24 Karat. So I could have put this bunny over top, but I just really liked that. And th these are the stickers, the paper, my lawn fawn pixie dust. I mean, come on, how cute is that? So I just love making tags so much, but I never have anywhere to display them. So they always, I always give them away. And I thought, what a great idea to make something for my desk, making something for everyone else. How about make something for my desk and display it with every season and write my memories or just decorate the back. So if you decorate the back for display, you'd want to do it upside down, I guess. But how cute is this? I really want to pu push this up so you guys can see how shiny and sparkly this is. Now I've seen people make this out of paper I don't really understand how you would get a smooth roll with that, but you know, I, I guess if you love building stuff. So I'm gonna keep this one up, keep these down. And if anything gets too tall or too bulky, we made it, we can trim it down. So I'm glad I bought those because everything would be hanging down if I didn't, so. That's cool. Well, thanks for watching. If you were curious what the Heidi Swap Blush Memory Dex holder looked like, this is what it looks like. These are the little silicone holders. And thanks for watching. If you're curious what I come up with next, click subscribe. Thanks. Bye.